Well, that'd be a done quest now. I returned the ancient suit of armor to the knights, who seemed eager to have it. They spoke of a brother traitor and of being free. It seems I have released them from a timeless curse. Well, aren't we cool as hell? Alright, now if I'm not mistaken, there were some kobolds over this way. Dead end there, kobolds down there. That actually seems to lead in this direction. So that's interesting. Alright, just kobolds so we can re-equip our normal slashing weapons. Okay. Hmm, what's the best way to handle that? I suppose Air Carrot could try to go hero mode and... Yeah, sure. He's feeling a little cocky. Just gonna use mirror image. He's gonna run out there. He's gonna throw a skull trap their way. Ooh, or he's just gonna get shot with arrows and have spell failure and get badly hurt and embarrass himself in front of everyone. Yeah, that's that's much more poetic, I think. Alright, and everybody else will handle it. Because apparently mirror image was not good enough to handle that problem. And uh, everyone else is just going to kind of laugh at him a little bit. So he got all cocky, thought he could handle it by himself. And clearly he couldn't. And so, Garrett learns a lesson about humility. Probably a much needed lesson. So when it comes to fire arrows, even mirror image isn't good enough. Alright, M1. I have you searching for traps again. Looking for traps. Peeking around the corner. Quick saving to stop the battle music. It's actually rather useful. I mean, because <laughs> it stops it, which, you know, no more annoying sound, and it saves your progress, so it really performs two very useful functions. And it kind of encourages you to make saving a habit, rather than an exception, which is actually probably rather positive. Uh, you know, that's, that's nice. Alright, everybody, we're back where we started. We all know this leads back to the village. This short distance, apparently eight hours away on land, <laughs> equals, uh, apparently there must be a very long tunnel behind this, goes back to the Firewind Bridge area, which we already explored thoroughly. And I guess the only way left is to go this way. I am gone. And see what lies beyond. Hopefully a more awful traps than Immo and Will hopefully not set off. Very carefully. Very carefully. Ooh, like the one right at her feet. Phew. Close one. Alright, anyone would call back for the party to move up. What? Oh, crap. Kobold's coming from the rear. Attack! Oh, wow. Okay. Apparently, Diny here and Carrot working uh, as a team were able to <laughs> knock down the kobold before it could do anything nasty. That's nice. Alright, everybody else over here. Emwyn, get going. Oh, crap, there they are. Sword ready, hide. Alright, Emwyn. It's commando time. Oh, wait, there's three of them. Alright, maybe it's not commando time. Maybe it's let's send in the muscle time. Alright, everybody. Charge! Okay. I remember playing through this dungeon years ago as a teenager and didn't really have a great grasp of the rules and how the game worked. Oh, it was brutal. Absolutely brutal. 
I remember not enjoying myself very much going through this dungeon. <laughs> uh -oh. Hide. Uh huh. She hid. Where are you? You're here by yourself. Oh, you blow up. Oh, you're coming after us, huh? Well, we hide again. This is a major exploit of this game, by the way. I'm only doing it now because I don't know. I actually think it's kind of funny. That's why I'm doing it. It's because it seems so conceptually absurd. And I'm just like, yeah, let's let's do it. It's fun. <laughs> yes, oh omnipresent authority for the group. Alright, everyone. I bet there's traps down this way too. Let's certainly get the bow out. Big long hallway. Very much doubt anybody's gonna be able to sneak up on her. Enemies! It's exciting! A whole bunch of enemies. Alright, they're just out of reach there. Okay. Now this is gonna be where Tiny here shows Carrot how it's done. And you have to be careful and stay just out of their visible range. So all they hear is, oh hey, what's that sound coming from down the hallway there? And then, kaboom! Boom! Problem solved. I am gone. Name arrows. Can she actually identify them? She can. Perfect. Yes, she's seen enough of them. That's useful. I've done had enough of this. Very carefully, moving down the hallway, looking out for traps. Traps, traps, traps. Where are the traps? Huh, apparently not in this hallway. All right, should call back for everybody to come up. As you direct. Peek around the corner. Nothing there. Moving up carefully. All right. Gonna get her sword out. Gonna try to hide. Sure enough. Oh wow. Apparently there's some a hostile mage here. Kobolds. Yeah, that's got danger written all over it. Alright, party. There's danger afoot. And there may be traps up ahead. So it's a generally dicey situation to begin with. Alright, so what should we do to prepare ourselves? Uh do I guess stone skin for Khalid, because he tends to get hurt a lot. Gonna keep that paralyzation wand ready. That might be really useful. Ghost armor. And mirror image. Carried. I think he'll cast improved invisibility on himself. Or no. He's gonna cast it on... <laughs> He's gonna cast it on Minsk. And be like, surprise, it's Minsk. Okay, Minsk, go forward and just make sure that you watch that that wizard. If he tries anything bad, you make him regret it. Okay, there's a kobold. We'll get rid of him. Yep, he's doing something. Well, stop him. Oh, crap. He went invisible. Improved invisible. That's a fourth level spell. Oh, dear. Alright, where are you? Okay, we need to cast Dispel Magic quick. Carrot is definitely going to back away from that. 
Actually, he's going to cast horror, see maybe if he can scare anybody else in the area. Anyone's going to move back. There he is. Take cover. Oh, we stopped him? Move back. Oh, wow. Apparently Mint's got a few lucky hits in. That's all that took. Apparently the Dispel Magic did not affect his invisibility. But Minsk was still able to whack him and take care of him. Only one hit? Oh, I got two good hits in. Oh, Minsk did his job. Apparently there was an Ogrillin, some Kobolds. And that mage was definitely hostile. Oh, hey, non-mundane arrows, please. Okay. All right, anything else that I'm missing? All right, valuables. Ooh, a whole bunch of nice stuff. What's that? Mage robe of electrical resistance. Ooh, a potion of power. Nice. What's this? Quarterstaff? Nah. Ocean of stone form. I think Kali has something like that. Yeah. All right. And a whole bunch of really... Oh, wow. 159 gold. And a whole bunch of really nasty looking spells. Wow. Including cloud kill? Holy guacamole. Uh-huh. Yeah. All right. We got to find somewhere to offload some of the crap that we're carrying now. <laughs> wow, alright. Quickly running out of space here. Eww, I guess we'll just drop some of the stuff that isn't really that valuable. Let's see. Cool touch. That's a fireball, and that looks like lightning bolt. Nobody has a room for the robe? Really? Can anybody put, like, a, I don't know, a ring on or something? <laughs> Here you go, Minsk. Here, wear the... Khalid, wear the pretty ring. Here, Jahiri, you get one, too. Wear this nice pretty ring that Khalid got for you. Because we need inventory space. Alright, what was it? This one. Alright, now he's encumbered because he can't carry anything because he's Khalid. That's how he rolls, apparently. Alright, have some arrows, then. Minsk will carry that. Oy, oy, oy. Okay, so that's cool that we found some of that stuff. Let's very carefully move forward. Whoa! Run, everyone, run! Okay, attack! What the hell is that thing? Oh, wow. I think that's an ogre mage. Alright, party, get ready. Or hell, white. He's right there. He's coming toward this. He's obviously hostile. Let's hurt him. Let's hurt him badly. Chromatic orb. I'm Screw him up. Alright, well, he's stunned. I suppose I can just take care of him. Although, I don't know. Let's find out. He's running away now. Let's at least find out what he has to say. Let's just surround him. The AI is off, so they won't automatic automatically attack. Oh, he died from Carrot's spell. 